Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. I'm excited to share with you a simple and free method to save submissions from the Contact Form 7 plugin directly to Google Sheets. We'll achieve this without any additional plugins. All you'll need to do is copy and paste some code. So let's dive right in. First, open up a new Google Sheets document, go to the Extensions menu and select App Script. Next, head over to the link in the video description to grab the Google Apps Script code. Copy the code and paste it into the App Script Editor. Make sure to delete any existing code before pasting the new one, and then save your script. Once you've done that, click on the Deploy button, choose New Deployment, select Web App as the type, and add a brief description for your web app. Remember to set the access option to anyone and then click Deploy. Now, since this is your first time running the app, you will need to authorize access to your Google account. Simply click Authorize Access and follow the steps to complete the authorization process. Copy the URL of your web app, as we'll need it for the next steps. Run your app once to ensure everything works fine. You should see a new sheet named Email Log created in your Google Sheets. Go back to the post and copy the second code. To insert this code into your website, you have a couple of options. If you're using a child theme, paste the code into your themes functions file. If you need help creating a child theme, don't worry, check out my tutorial on that. Another option is using free plugins like Code Snippets. I've already installed and used it myself. Navigate to the Snippets menu, click Add New, and paste the code you copied earlier. Make sure to insert the Google Apps URL you created into the code. Give your snippet a title, save it, and activate it. Now let's test it out. Fill out a form on your site and you'll see the submission automatically added to your Google Sheets. Let's do it one more time, just to be sure. There you have it. You've successfully connected Contact Form 7 to Google Sheets without using any extra plugins. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you found it helpful, please give it a like. It means a lot to me. And if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you can stay up to date with my latest tutorials. See you in the next one.